You're my sister, and I love you, but I'm really worried that you're focusing so much on everyone else's dreams that you're forgetting about your own. Incoming! Hey! Uh, Emma! Damn, it's been a while. A year. I was only going so fast because you I... You were late? Reminds me of our first date. And only date. You're the best man. Best friend, best man, usually that's how it works. And you're maid of honor. Sister, maid of honor, tends to work that way too. And you still do those affirmations, I see. Brave. I am brave. You're gonna love my speech. <laughs> we have to get over there now. We cannot afford to lose this deal. I'll just hire a wedding planner. There's no time for that. Unless wedding stand-in. You want me to be a what? A wedding stand-in. It's simple. I already have all the meetings set up with the vendors, so you guys will go. As you. For us. You aren't pretending to be us. You're representing us. These, I like. You've got quite the eye. Can you pick us out a flower? Yep. Somehow, we both agreed the second we saw it. We're just getting along better than I expected. And that first date wasn't that bad, was it? I wasn't really ready to open up. I think if we want to find the perfect band, we gotta dance to them first. I have to find at least one option for tomorrow if I want a tasting. I think you're pushing your sanity. That's why you have me. You're not doing this on your own, remember? I wanted to present the client with something a little more personal. Emma, these are incredible. We're opening a new firm in Seattle. I immediately thought of you, and you'd be the queen of corporate events there. If you stay, what do you have to lose in Seattle? And if you go, what do you have to lose here? So you're still moving? You took the job? I can't take the promotion. You've shown us all today that second chances are worth it.